And joining me now to discuss, Rebecca Grant, IRIS Independent Research President. Rebecca, always great to see you. Uh, you know, great to have you back on the show. Your take on Vladimir Putin's trip to the Middle East coming after President Biden's trip to the Middle East. I mean, the timing of this uh, is, is uncanny here. There are not many places that Putin can go. He's only been on one trip since the Ukraine war started. So the, the reason he's going is to check in with Iran and with Turkey on the Syria peace process, which Russia is a part of, if you can believe it. But the White House has told us that there may be a missile uh, and uh, rather um, a drone deal in the works. So I think there's no question that Putin is kind of driven crazy by Biden going on this trip and he wants to make sure he's doing something as well. It's kind of unbelievable. It almost sounds like, um, you know, they're kids and they have to try to one up each other, Putin much more so than uh, President Biden in, in that respect. But, you know, it's also really troubling when you think about China's relations with Iran and the fact that Iran could be helping with its military efforts, Russia's military efforts in, in Ukraine, when the United States has, has spent so much to, to thwart those efforts. And so it really comes back to what we're seeing foreign policy-wise um, with respect to this administration, not really able to kind of hold the bad actors at bay. You're right. China is very much a part of this, of course, because of their guarantees to Russia, their energy purchases and their diplomatic top cover. They've also been helping Iran, of course, with military technology and China buys Iran's oil. So it sort of is a meeting of two of the bad guys with China not in the meeting, but very much in the mix and supporting at this point both Russia and Iran in all their nefarious aims. So I am sorry to see this taking place. Yeah, I think I think a lot of people are. And as this war in Ukraine um, continues to drag on much longer than, than everybody thought, um, and it's costing a lot more than everybody thought, uh, I think the analysis is, is, you know, stepping back and saying something should have been done earlier. Prevention would have been the best step here. Um, and yet here we are now Putin's traveling to Iran. So, Rebecca, thank you so much for coming on. Always great to see you and get your... Thank you. Spectacular insight. Thank you.